Hi everyone, I welcome you back to this channel Technical Drawing Masterclass. So this is part two of our video. I'd just made uh, part one of this same video whereby I showed you how you can draw um, the walls, uh, put in the doors and the windows up to where uh, this drawing is. So we are using this uh, drawing as uh, our reference drawing just that uh, I just want to reproduce this same drawing right here such so that you can get to know how um, I came up with uh, this drawing so it's part two of our video please if you haven't watched part one I urge you that uh, you 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 watch it um, before proceeding with part two all I'll leave and leave a link of uh, part one of this video in the description box so uh, let's get started so in this part two we are going to handle uh, four four tasks how to put the hatch then how to put the text then how to put the card objects this one is right here then also I will do the labeling of the dozen windows so um I urge you that uh, you stick with me until the end of this part two of this video such that you get to know exactly um, how I managed to come up with this uh, drawing so let's get started so first I'll click on the layer command then I'll select the layer for hatch then I'll click on the hatch command So when it opens up, I'll select um, this hatch, hatch command for the wall, for the hatch of the walls. So I'll click at it, then I'll give it a scale of 1000, then also um, I'll leave the transparency as it is, then after I'll click the enter key at the keyboard. So I'll just click in between those lines that illustrate the alignment of the walls. So when you're done uh, with putting in the hatch, next what we're going to do is uh, put the text. But before putting the text, um, let's uh, put the card objects such that uh, we can easily uh, get the space available for putting in uh, the, the what the text. So right now I'm just going to copy uh, these card objects from. And this reference drawing but uh, before I made the video on how you can uh, copy card objects from another AutoCAD uh, drawing file to to the current drawing file that you're using so uh, I'm going to leave a link of that video in the description uh, section so if you haven't watched that video uh, you'll use this chance and uh, check out in that in the description section then you can always uh, watch that video such that you get aligned with uh, what I'm uh, teaching you right now so I'll highlight uh, every object that I have in my reference drawing So when I'm done with highlighting uh, those uh, objects, I'll click at the copy command. Then I'll get a reference point 
uh, like the way I did uh, in part one of this same video when I was trying to copy and paste these um, those and the windows from this uh, reference drawing to, to the new drawing. So I'll get this. I'll click at this uh, corner right here. Then I zoom in. Then after that, I'll click at that same corner right there. Then I'll press escape. So you find that I've easily transferred um, these card objects in my reference drawing. So they're in the same position as they are in this reference drawing. So let's uh, put in the text. So after that, I'll, cl I'll click at my layer for text. Then I'll click at the text command. You can either use this method or you can um, always copy and paste um, from from this reference drawing but uh, for, for now uh, let me show you how to put the text using this method so I'll put in bedroom So I'll kind of increase its height to the text height to 2000, I mean 200. Then I'll move this text right here. So I'll just copy. The same text right here and right there and right there and right there and right also lastly at that point right there so I'll double click at that text then I'll edit it to living room Then this one, I'll double click at it. Then I'll edit it to kitchen. Then this one, I'll edit it to dining. Then this one, I'll edit it to porch. Now I'll try to move it roughly at the middle of the porch, right there. Then this one, I'll edit it to WC. Then I'll try to move it right there. So next, what I'm going to do next is uh, to put uh, the what? I'm going to label the the windows and the doors. So I'll highlight all these labels that I have right here. All tags
so i'll click at the copy command so after that still i'll use this same point as my reference point then i'll i'll just copy and paste them to my new drawing right here So this is the end of uh, part two of our video. So in part three of our video, I'll show you how to put the grid lines and also how to put uh, the dimensions. So um, if this video has been of importance to you, uh, please don't forget to leave a like, comment if there is anything that uh, I've left behind and I've not talked about. I welcome your comments in the comment section then also um, don't forget to subscribe to the channel that's one way you can support me to continue uploading videos and also you can share this kind of content to friends relatives that you feel like they need of this kind of content thanks for watching we we'll meet in part three of this video